Welcome to my sunny, sunny terrace. Ah, and I'm welcoming the sun. <laughs> I feel like a empty depression flow today because it has been raining for days in Parma and it's like the weather is like returning back to winter. It's even worse than winter because it's, pure, it's not only purely just cold, but not so much rain here. But in the last days, it was just pouring rain all the time and so cold. I had to start the fireworks again, the fireplace again, not the fireworks. So I feel, I, I felt even a little bit depressed with this rainy days and cold, you know, kind of like a feel trapped. And the sun kills, kills the depression and brings all the energy back. So that's why today I am sharing with you a lovely flow that is anti-depression and energy, energy boosting. It's really good for doing it in like this odor under the sun. But if you don't have it, you can also do it at home. So we will have a lot of chest opening, heart opening poses and it's very gentle and soothing, it's therapeutic. I hope you guys enjoy this flow at the end. And um, yeah, so let's get it started. I'll meet you kneeling at the end of our mat. Above my head, but a little bit there. So when I'm opening my heart, I want to make sure that I open it to the to the sun. That makes sense. <laughs> All right. So now we are kneeling at the back of our mat. So we'll just do a few rounds of seated, kneeling, seated, head to toe. Spine in a fluid motion, create a play left to right, clockwise, anti clockwise, just to warm up the spine together with the breaths. Mm -hmm. So good. your fingers and the palms facing front and push it out from in front of you from the back a little stretch of your upper back the second of them so it's like a really round cap push the arms away exhale in inhale lift up you lift your entire upper body up Lengthening the spine and exhale, bring the hands interlace behind your lower back and pull it down towards the ground like somebody from the earth is pulling it down. Pinch the shoulder blades together and open the throat and heart to the sky, to the sun, and release. So we will do this gentle kneeling heart opening stretching flow by adding one pose at a time so in the end it will be a very complete flow but we'll add it little by little so that you don't feel like it's a lot at the beginning it's really soothing i promise you interlace the hands again Ex inhale exhale push the hands away from yourself stretch the upper back the neck Inhale, lift up. Uh, shoulders away from it, uh, the ears. And still bring it behind you. Pull it down towards the, sky, uh, towards the earth. And release. And now this, this one we will add a little bit. 
push away, exhale, round the back. Inhale, lift the arms. Exhale, bring the hands towards the right. Stretch on the left side. Inhale, bring the to center. Exhale, to the right side. Stretch on the right. Open uh, the shoulder. Open the right shoulder so that your gaze is facing the sky through your right arm. Come back to center. Inhale. Lift your hips, come onto your shins, and release. Inhale, bring the hands interlace behind the lower back, exhale, pinch your shoulder blades together, and bring the chest up towards the sky. Open your throat, if you can, because it comes with a back bend. Just be gentle with yourself. If you cannot, drop your head backward, open your throat. So just tap your chin into your chest, only open the chest. The same motion with the hands, like somebody dropping you down. But in the meantime, you push your hips forward. So that you, in the meantime, you're also lifting the chest up. Chest is lifting up, hips moving forward, arms pulling down. All those. I have to talk. For those of you who can, also you can throw your back, throw your head backwards and open the throat. And release, come down. <sighs> I hope you're already feeling a little bit of energy boosting with this heart opening uh, back bend process. Make sure that you take a lot of oxygen in that's the key with the motions with the movement with the poses you keep the breath working keep the prana going and take big breaths in and out that way you feel more um the energy is more lifted okay so interlace the hands push it away exhale inhale lift up and Exhale, bring it to the right. Inhale, center. Exhale, bring it to the left. Side stretch. Face up. Inhale, lift the hips up. And exhale, interlace the hands. Release the hands and interlace it behind the lower back. And push down. Inhale, exhale, so back. Inhale, come back. Relax the release. Mm. Relax a little bit. Feel the difference. Feel the energy flow. Now let's add in not egg. So push it away. Inhale, lift it up. Exit to right. Inhale back to center. Exit to left. Inhale, lift the hips up. Release. Inhale, cross the fingers. Exit to the chest up. Let's pull it down. Inhale, come back to center. Exhale. Keep the hands interlaced behind you. Okay, we inhale. Exhale, bend forward. Shoulder stretch as well. Let your hands drop as far as possible behind your head to the front direction of the mat. Inhale here. Exhale, let the hips up. And come into a 90 degrees on your knees and your hips and place the crown of your head down towards the mat. Inhale here, exhale, bring the hips back 
to the heels, release the hands in front of you in the chair. Okay, three rounds of big inhale. Slowly lift yourself back into the kneeling position. Mm. One more flow like this, then we will add on more. Exhale, push the hands away. Inhale, lift up and switch to the right. Inhale to center. Exhale to the right. Hips up. So bring the hands behind the lower back. Push down. Strong. Open throat. Inhale, come back to center. Pull down. Keep the hands interlaced. And then forward. Exhale. Shoulder stretch. Inhale here. Exhale, lift the hips. Come onto the crown of your head. Exhale, release. Hands in front of you and chop the toes. And to lift yourself up. To kneeling, settle in. Feel the difference now. How do you feel? A little bit open up, I hope. Inhale, exhale, you place the hand, push away, and run your back. Chain, inhale, lift, hands up, exit to the right. Inhale to the center, exit to the left. Inhale, lift the hips up. Exhale, release and interlace the hands behind the lower back and open the chest towards the sky. Back leg. Inhale, come back down. And bend forward. Exhale, lift the hips. Come on to the crown of your head. And stay here for two rounds of breaths. Two more rounds of breaths. Mm. Exhale, release. Hands forward. And now from here, inhale, round your back like a cat. And lift yourself up into table top. When you come down to the shoulders on top of your wrist, come into a cow pose. Stick your sit bones out. <laughs> like, how do you say this? Like, like, just curve your pubic bone and stick your butt out. And bring it back. Exit. The chest. One more round. Curl up. Inhale. Exhale. Cow pose of bring the hips back to the heel. Oh, yeah. Lift our body up. One complete flow like this. One more time. Inhale. Exhale. Bring the hands. Away. Um, sorry. <laughs> Come to center. To the right. Exit. To the center. To the left. Mm. Lift the toes up. Hips up. Bring the hands to into place behind the lower back. Open the chest. forward. 
and onto the crown of the head. And bring the hips down to the heels of each hand. Round, tuck, tuck the chin in, round the back. Come, this time come mm, your shoulders a little bit over your wrist, kind of like lift your hip down, like upward, upward facing or like um, high cobra, knees down, right? You know, upward facing this high cobra. Open chest, bring the elbows, like externally located shoulder, bring the elbows close to the body, like your hands, both of your hands are like opening a bottle cup of the jaw. And bring the hips back. Mm -hmm. This time, just lift yourself up, come into a tabletop, tap your toes, and we'll, come, we'll sit on top of our heels with the knees bent, toe squat. Mm. Five rounds of breath here. It's hard, but it's well, in, you know, our body needs stretch, but our ankles, our tendons, our these small joints also need stretches. So this area is normally will be neglected by us. The years, if you do stress them, they will also get rusty, you know? So this toe squat, perfect for stretching out your um, bows of your feet, your toes, and your ankles. All right, come back to tabletop. Tap your foot, okay. Relax. We'll come into a kneeling position again. Bring the body a little bit backwards and place the hands behind your hips and lift your knees up. A little gentle ankle stretch. Don't overdo it. Just make sure that you don't over stretch this part. It's very sensitive. You can also put a pillow underneath your knees so that your knees are not in too much tension will come forward and back into this kneeling position. All right, so how do you feel so far? Do you feel like one more time to repeat this flow with me? A little bit faster, okay? Inhale, push away. Inhale, lift up, exit to the right. Inhale to center, exit to the left. Inhale back to center with the hips. And exit, bring your hands down and back. Pull down. Inhale, sit back down. Exit, bring over. Stretch the shoulders in front of us. Here, exit on onto the palm of the head and release arms forward. Tuck the chin in and take your cat, blow it out. Like Dip the hips down, come into a high cobra. Open collar bones, yeah, elbows together. Exhale, breathe, but back to the We'll come onto a tabletop, exhale, tap the toes, and come into a toe squat. Two rounds of breath here, this toe squat. Hold. Opening even in the smallest area of our body. And come into a tabletop, tap the feet, relax the muscles, and come into an ankle stretch. Take the knees off the floor. Come back to 
community position. Now we'll come into the tabletop. Okay, runs up, spread the needles. Take the inhale, and you bring the weight on the top of the right hand and bring it to the left. Peel it up to the sky. Gaze on your fingertips and exhale. Spread the needles on the knees of the right hand. Okay. And three times like this. Inhale, open up, exhale, spread the needles, but don't completely rest your cheek on the mat. Or do one last time. Open up, inhale, and exhale, spread the needles. And this time we will relax our cheek. Um, just the position for Inhale, peel the arm up and lift the left fingertips all the way towards the sky. And we are already in this um, twisted position, opening to the left side. And now we'll just use our core strength to lift ourselves up. And um, windmill the arms, you know, like wing the left hand down and place it behind our lower back for support. Lift our right arm to, toward the sky. Half camel pose. Back bend again. Open up. If you feel like so, tuck your toes, or even not tuck your toes. And place the left fingertips on the left toe. Push the hips forward a little bit more. Open up. And lift the left hand to the right. Bring hands together at heart center. Come back onto the kneeling position and rest. Now we'll come onto the right side. Are you ready? <laughs> I promise you this is gonna the end soon, but you will feel so good. Come to come onto the tabletop. Take the green hand and the right hand towards the sky. Open up and cross the needles three times. Inhale, open. Exhale. Cross the needles. Spread the needles. <laughs> cross under. Last time, open, open, open. Try to uh, stack your hips on top of your knees. My hips are moving around. I, I realize that. But try to stabilize your hips. Don't make them moving around like this. <laughs> now we'll stay in this twisted pose for two longer breaths. <laughs> Take big inhale, lift yourself up, open to the right again, and use your core to push yourself up, up, up. Place your right hand behind the lower back, lift your left arm up. Tap your toes, bring the right hand on top of your right toe, right heel, and push the hips even further, open the chest even more towards the side. Bring the right hand to meet the left and play the at heart center. Exhale. Bring the hips down. Come back onto the knee. So open up. This is so empty impression. Actually, I feel even happier. Now we'll come gently and slowly at your own pace and in your own way will come to meet in downward facing okay this is our first and our last downward facing lift, lift the hips up keep the knees bent gently you don't have to push them straight to them 
release spin curl the whole time. So just relax the hamstrings. Just stay in this diamond feet involved for a few moments. Bend one knee at a time just to relax the hamstrings. Once, once you are ready, slowly walk the feet towards your hips to the top of the mat. Or come into a red dog pose. <laughs> Hold the elbows of your arms with your hands. You dump your body down. Help and relax. Upper body, your Head your neck, let it hang toward the ground, toward the mother earth. <sighs> and keep your knees generously bent, and then that you can feel like your upper body are totally rested on your on your thighs. So from here, very lazy and very zombie like. Lift your upper body up. Keep the knees bent. Just lift yourself up on your on the hips. And once at the top, open the arms like cactus shape. Once again, open yourself to the sky. Pinch the shoulder blades in. Like actually bring your elbows towards each other. And cross your fingers behind the lower back and push it down and then straighten the knees and push your hips forward. Open your chest. And that bend. <clears throat> and come back to center. Inhale. Exhale. <laughs> One more time. <laughs> Hands up, inhale. Exhale. Dive down gently. Pinch at hips. And come into a forward fold. Angle here for a few moments. Feel the stretch of your lower back and your hamstrings. Bend the knees generously. Move this up bottom. I let your body be really, really heavy and lazy. Let yourself go. Little by little, vertebra by vertebra. Keep the knees bent. Once at the top, open the arms to cactus. Open the car to the sky. Bring the elbows in. And to place the hands behind you and bend the knees. Push the hips forward, open the chest and throat. Once again. Last time. Come back to center. Inhale. And exhale. Mm. This is it. Oh, you can also do this um, as you can. You know, like by adding a little more onto the flow, you can do two or three times to repeat each each small flow. You can do like I did only two two times to repeat two times on each flow, adding another one, but you can do three or four as gentle as slow as you want. Also the last two you can do two, three. It's really good. And as long as you have the time, just give yourself a little more self-love. I hope you really, really enjoyed this flow with me again on my beautiful Paris. You are always welcome to join me in person <laughs> or virtually on video. And thank you so much if you like my channel click the subscribe button and we'll have more flows, more contents coming out every week. 
I'll see you in the next vlog.